take their seats. Um, we're about to begin right now. Consulada Chanfran, meu nome é Angela, minha voluntária na Associação Caverdiana na Broughton. Hoje ainda bem ser nós Master de Cerimônia. Sou nasce na América, sou crioulo, minha crioula é muito bom, mas hoje ainda bem nós minha crioula de América. So my name is Angela Gonsalves. I'm from the association. I'm a volunteer there. And today I'm going to be your master of ceremonies. Um, so we're about to begin dinner right now. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to bless the food and bless tonight. So in just a few, I'm going to call up uh, Bishop Tony Branch. So que é nada nos abençoar no jantar, no viada. Antes que nos estar aquela, não tem que abençoar a comida e abençoar nos noti. So gostem também de uma Bishop Tony Branch para vender nos invocação. Good evening to everyone. Good evening to everyone. We have breath in our body, do we not? Are we breathing? Can we see and can we hear? So I want to say it one more time. Good evening, everyone. Now let us pray. Father God, in the name of the Jesus that I serve, Lord, I ask that you move throughout this place. Lord, from the crown of our heads to the soles of our feet, bless us as we are about to eat, but bless us in our ever walk of righteousness in this city. Lord, we ask that you bless the city of Brockton and the Commonwealth of Massachusetts. If you are believers, please say amen. Thank you, Bishop. E gostem de também estar no jantar, só se tudo alguém pode tomar seus lugar, não também estar a jantar, gostem. E também uh, durante o jantar, não tem tá rifa, alguém tá, está tendo com rifa, se nós quer comprar rifa, nós compra rifa, não tem os bons prêmios que não está dado lá na fim. I just want to thank everybody for coming out tonight. Uh, it's, a, it's wonderful to see you all. It's great to be part of this organization. And I want to make sure that you keep coming back because this event means a great deal to all of us. Uh, I'm not sure if you know this, but I'm also a city council here in the city. And the Cape Verdean community being the largest ethnic group in the city, it's important that we have these events on a regular basis to basically bring out the best of our community. I know we've got a great community, but once in a while we need to showcase it and show it. So I'm going to cut this very short because uh, I'm also hungry and um, I want to make sure that um, we uh, go through the program and then at the end we'll do a little to tell you a little bit of what the, uh, the association is actually doing nowadays. But thank you. Please enjoy your evening. There's, a, there's some wonderful music, some wonderful dancing that I expect everybody to get up and do something. So don't be shy. You know, this is your house, your place. So enjoy it. Okay. I'll see you guys later. That's the shortest Moses has ever spoken. That deserves another round of applause. Give him another round of applause. So thank you again, Moses. So I don't know if everybody in the back, can you guys hear me okay? Can you guys hear me okay? Okay, so I don't know if uh, you guys in the back can see, but we actually have Mayor Carpenter here. He's sitting right here at this front table. So let's give a round of applause for Mayor Carpenter. He's going to come up and say a few words. Well, good evening. I'll uh, try to be just as brief as uh, Moises, but I want to welcome everyone here tonight. This is a very special weekend uh, for the city of Brockton as we celebrate Cape Verdean heritage. I think that uh, the growing strength and influence and importance of the Cape Verdean community here in the city of Brockton is a, is a dynamic that we're very proud of. And I think that uh, as a community, this weekend uh, we are celebrating the community's Cape Verdean heritage I think it would be fair to say that uh, tomorrow we will also be celebrating the city's Cape Verdean heritage because the community has become such a large part of the city. Uh, so we are very uh, excited about the events tonight, looking forward to the festival tomorrow. And uh, I hope that everyone enjoys their dinner and we have a, a great weekend celebrating Cape Verdean heritage. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. 
also, a few moments ago, I was very lucky to have met um, our high sheriff. He is also here today, Mr. Joseph McDonald. So I know he was kind of shy, but if you could come up and say a few words, that'd be awesome. Thank you so much, everybody, for, uh, for coming out tonight, for making me part of the wonderful celebration of Cape Verdean culture. I have learned so much. I'm so happy. This is your 22nd uh, uh, dinner and festival. I'm, I'm glad to be part of this whole thing. And I'm going to aim like the mayor and Moises. I'm going to speak very briefly. Uh, when I was a kid, uh, my grandfather told me, God gave you two ears and one mouth. Maintain the ratio. So thank you all. <laughs> wow. <laughs> anyway, thank you everybody for making me part of this community. Thank you. So right now we're going to have dinner continue. Um, and shortly the music will be starting soon. And... Oh, so right now actually, before the music, we're actually going to have uh, Joe Miranda come up, Officer Joe Miranda come up. And he is the president of the association, so Joe. All right. I guess the schedule changed a little bit. We got improvised and conquered. And um, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for being here. Normally, this is the time of the event that the board wants me to come up and talk to you guys about our organization, all the work that we've done in the past year. But this year, I'm going to do a little bit different. I am not going to do that. I am not going to talk about all the work that we've done this past year. I'm not going to sit here and ask you guys to donate any money to the organization. <laughs> I'm not going to sit here and talk to you guys and explain to you guys all the money that was donated, where it went this year, and how we spent it. Because you guys are here today, it means that you guys are aware of all the work that we do, and you guys came here tonight because you guys truly believe in the organization and all the work that it's done. So this year, I am not going to tell you that the Kibber Association is a nonprofit organization. I am not going to tell you that it's located at 570. It's located at 575 North Montella Street in Brockton, in this great city of Champion. And most definitely, I'm not going to tell you guys about the different programs that we have, such as the after-school program, where we have a tutoring center for all the kids in our school system in the city of Brockton. I'm not gonna tell you about our summer uh, camp that we currently are running that have about 50 uh, children and about 10 youth counselors working and four youth volunteers. I'm not gonna tell you guys about those programs. And I'm most definitely not gonna tell you that we have an um, ESOL program and also, I'm not going to tell you about our citizenship class that we offer. I'm also not going to tell you about our father's program that recently 13 brave men just graduated a 13 weeks program because they want a better life for their children and they participated in, the, in this program. So congratulations to them for wanting a better future and becoming a better father. You guys already know about our walk-in service, and most important, the work that we do with the Department of Children and Families so our children can have a better future. I'm also not going to tell you about the great festival we had last year and how we are preparing and can't wait to celebrate tomorrow. Hopefully, we won't be able to dance in the rain. But most important is people like yourself that continue to support this organization today and for many more years to come, so thank you. I'm also now going to stand here and preach to the choir and explain to you guys how important our small building at 575 Montello Street has a huge heart and is your support throughout the year that makes and it moves it forward. And that's why I invite you guys to continue to support this small organization with a huge heart. At this time, I would like to thank Mayor Bill Carpenter for his support that he provides to our organization throughout the year. I also would like to say a special thank you to our Cape Verdean Consulate, Pedro Carvalho, 
who's been supporting us for the past seven years. Normally they come here for six years, but he's been with us for seven. I thank you for all the work that you do and continue to support the association. I also want a, a special thank you to Sheriff Joe from McDonald and his staff for always accommodating our request. There is, there, is, there is not enough words to describe the live performers that we're gonna have here tonight with us. I'm gonna start off with Easy Daughter. And Easy Daughter Vargas, they've been with the association before I even started. I grew up listening to, to them singing for our k Day. I remember back then at, this, um, at the city hall. And Easy Daughter Vargas, no matter what we ask for them, they always there to support this organization. So thank you, Isidora Vargas. <laughs> Another great musician we're gonna have with us today, again, is someone that was there way before I, and I think he will be there after I leave, is Chesco. Again, he's the type of person that no matter how we, no matter how we ask and when we ask, he's there. Again, thank you, Chesco. I first met Dennis Gracia about maybe 10 years ago when I first got involved with the association. We asked him to perform for us for a fundraiser dinner. Dennis is also another person that even last minute, you call him, he's there and wants to support. And that's why we invite him back again this year. This year we decided to do something a little bit different for the, for the gala and also for the CV Day uh, celebration. We decided to focus more on local artists to showcase the talent that we have here with us in the city. And that's why they're here again tonight. I also wanna say thank you to all the staff and volunteers that put this day together. I'm gonna uh, mention some names, the k Verde Day Committee volunteers. We have Monica Tavares, Ani Vega, Maria Pinto, Maria Harris, Maria Rodriguez, and most important, Nyo Nyo. Nyo, -Nyo is another volunteer that was there before I, and he will continue to be there. He's continued to support us in everything that we do. Thank you, Nyo And all the staff that we have at the association that makes this day possible. I have Adolfo, Denise, Carla, Carla Gonzalez, Haza, uh, Marisa, we have Carlos Silva, Alex Haza, who is our new case manager office um, employee, and Alberto, who's our clinical coordinator, and Moses Rodriguez, executive director. And also, I'd, I'd like to take this time to call up on the board. I'm gonna call the board members to come up so you guys can see their faces, and you guys can see the people that's out there representing this community. Hopefully they're ready. Domingos de Pina. Where are you, Domingos? Bishop Tony Branch. Diva Centeio. Elisa Fonts. Carlos Silva. Sylvester Fortz. Nick Tavares, Marlene Amadi, Kenneth Lingunya, hope I didn't butcher that name, Jvino Perez, Manuel Andrade, Nancy Lopes, our clerk, Manuel Centeio, our treasurer, And our newly elected vice president. This is a person who just got on not too long ago and he showed a lot of initiative, a lot of dedication, and I am happy that he's currently serving as my vice president, George Dos Santos.
ladies and gentlemen, this is a board of the Cape Breton Association. And I would like to say a special thanks to Tufts Health Now Plan and RMS, the resident, resident mortgage services. I would also encourage you, everyone, to take a look at the program book and support those that support our organization. Thank you. I have to apologize to the staff members. I think it's only fair if we called them up so you guys can see all the ladies and boys and girls at the Cabernet Association that does all the hard work behind the scene. So I would actually call them up so you guys can see their faces so you can actually take a group picture. I'm going to start with Denise Lopes, who does the ESOL uh, teaching, and um, Celis Almides. I know they're here, so they're coming. Thank you. Carla Gonçalves, Haza, Combs, and Mari Mari Marissa. Marisa. Alex Hauser, Alberto Alves, and Moses Rodriguez. Sorry, it's actually Marissa Sterling. Sorry, Marissa. These are the men and women behind the scene that answer the phones and do all the work that I take credit for. So thank you. Yes. And earlier I did the volunteer portion. I said the names really fast. I didn't give them a chance to get up. So Monica Tavares, where are you? Where are you, Monica? Monica, stand up and wave. Stand up and wave. That's Monica Tavares. Ani Vega. Where are you, Ani? Thank you, Ani. Maria Pinto. I think she's still out there. Maria Harris. I see you. Stand up, please. Stand up, Maria. Come on. There you go. Wave. Now wave. Maria Rodrigues, go ahead, stand up. I see you too. Yes? Part of the committee that put this day together, so stand up. This room looks beautiful, you guys believe? You guys agree with me? It thanks to Maria and Annie Vega. Uh, our friend uh, Bill Carpenter and his staff, all uh, uh, Americans, elected elect officials with us tonight. Special Mayor, for all support you provide to the Kivanian community and also for your friendship with Kivan and Kivanian authorities. Thank you, Mayor. Uh, Now, one of the words that I would like to say in Creole is that I would like to say in this moment, but it's a pleasure to do this. Mesmo em poucas palavras, flanhou-se que a comunidade cavoriana na Brockton acho que tem tudo motivos para celebrar esse dia. Primeiro, que as razões que eu queria apontar, portanto, tem tchau razões, mas eu queria destacar apenas uns três ou quatro. Primeiro, é uma comunidade que praticamente, em termos numéricos, ali na cidade de Brockton, acho que te ocupa a segunda ou terceira posição, na todos os grupos étnicos que constituem a população da cidade. Se não me falha a memória, a comunidade cavoriana na Brockton é, é um total de 130 mil pessoas da cidade, ele, a comunidade cavoriana é cerca de um quarto de aquela. Portanto, tem um peso grande na cidade. Uh, no Tespia, em termos econômicos, uh, sobretudo na parte comercial, uh, portanto, o número expressivo de cabo-verdianos 
te destaca na economia, se basta hoje que eh, Main Street de Broughton praticamente é dominado para pa negócios cavordianos. Portanto, tudo e eh, contribuição que a atividade comercial praticada para a comunidade cavo, membros da comunidade cavordiana te dá a cidade de, de Broughton. Depois, não tem eh, cavordianos, comunidade cavordiana, ali na cidade, eh, te destaca agora, tem no domínio político, não tem um peso eh, político, inesumente importante, que o pessoa se ocupa posições que te acaba para, enfim, eh, dar uma outra projeção à comunidade cavordiana ali na cidade e também eh, eh, a nível dos Estados Unidos da América. Na área cultural, também te destaca. Na área de educação, te destaca, sobretudo, nova geração de cavordianos. No estúdio Monte, te, 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 te sobressei agora como, com o nível de mestrado, doutoramento, eh, estudantes jovens, eh, te dedica fortemente eh, para estudo e acaba, isso te contribui para a comunidade cavordiana ter uma qualidade de longe superior, incomparavelmente superior, aquilo que era uns tempos atrás. Uh, uh, até no domínio acadêmico também, não tem pessoas que fazem doutoramento, uh, cada vez mais uh, números se aumenta. Portanto, uh, não tem um montão de outras razões que te fazem com que hoje uh, a comunidade cavordiana uh, tem razão para celebrar para celebra esse dia. Mas dentro que lá, uma comunidade, de modo, de modo aquele que não tem ali na Brockton, ele, é, é, talvez é, que, é, que, é ser aquilo que é hoje, se é que estivesse unido, se é que tivesse líderes associativos, a Associação Moda, a Associação Covilhana de Brockton, que tem dado uma contribuição forte para que de facto hoje não tenha essa comunidade. Por isso que eu queria aproveitar esse momento, na nome do Consulado Geral de Cabo Verde, na, na Boston, para, um vez mais, felicita a associação, todo o board, membros do board da associação, todos os líderes da comunidade cabo que tem ali, para trabalho que se dado na mante, essa comunidade cabo cada vez mais unida, cada vez mais forte. E, um vez mais, sem, perder, sem roubar os mais tempo, eu queria, desta tribuna, Uh, manda nos tudo um abraço e, e, e flanhoso, para nos continua sempre nessa linha que Cabo Verde, toda a comunidade a nível dos Estados Unidos da América está sempre orgulhoso daquilo que nós é hoje. Dê-nos contribuição para o desenvolvimento da cidade de Broughton e ao mesmo tempo também dê-nos contribuição para o desenvolvimento de Cabo Verde. Obrigado, parabéns uma vez mais para os dias. Só gostei no dia fim da nossa primeira parte de noite, só Gostem também de nós, fim de nós jantar e depois de que nada, nós também começamos aqui a segunda parte de nós noite. So, right now we just finished our first half of the night and in just a little bit we are going to start our second half. So right now I'm just going to let you guys finish and enjoy the rest of your dinner. So I know I'm actually the part of the program that everyone was looking forward to tonight. I'm here. Hello everyone. Now I'm sure you guys will wake up and we'll get ready to start our night. Um, I'm here to represent some of the awards on behalf of the staff and the board here at the association. Um, as you guys probably know, or hopefully you don't know, maybe you don't know, we do all of our time on a volunteer basis on the board. So we know it takes a lot of time, a lot of commitment, a lot of energy, a lot of resources to actually make this organization run. And we understand that we're not the only ones out in the community that do that. We have people every single day who are working to help better our community. And we're here to honor some of those people tonight. Okay, you guys are embarrassing me because you look like you're here against your will. You're not having fun. You're not clapping. You're not screaming. You're not enjoying anything. These poor artists are sitting back there. If you don't do any of these things, what, these, what do you think they're gonna do? I, 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 know, I know times are tough. 
But we had a, a very good last week, at least in the, uh, actually it was this week, the convention. Did everybody see the convention? In Philadelphia? I know there's some of the Republicans in here that weren't really all that thrilled with our convention, but it was very good for us Democrats. Uh, and the Republicans had theirs, you know, I don't know, I think like in January or something. It doesn't really matter all that much, but I just wanna make sure that, you know what, these are great times for our country. These are inspiring times for our country, but you guys have to, have to come along. We can't do this alone, so when, <sighs> flowers again. When we call these individuals up, and I'm sure uh, they deserve a round of applause, and I wanna make sure that you guys recognize the efforts that these uh, individuals have put in our community. The first that we actually have uh, is a, a, a person in our community that has a, done a great deal of work in our city. He's also somebody that whenever there's an issue that happens in Cape Verde or an issue that happens here in the community, he's not afraid of roll, you know, rolling up his sleeves and reaching out to the Cape Verdean Association, reaching out to the community to ask us to do something. And it was very evident during the um, volcano eruption in Cape Verde. This individual actually rolled up his sleeve both financially and with his goodwill. So I want you guys all to give a round of applause to Domingos Vega, who is the owner of several businesses here in the city of Rockton, who's uh, awarded this partnership from the Cape Verdean Association to you for all that you do for the city of Rockton. He's also known as Santino, so if you guys don't know who Domingos uh, Vega is, his nickname is Santino. So congratulations and thank you very much for all that you do for our city. Wow, I'm not, I'm not so sure what to say, but I'm very pleased. It's always an honor to be recognized, especially in the city of Brockton, city of champion. I'm very happy and I'm, I'm sure my wife is my other half. Uh, we, all, we, all we have to say is thank you to board of uh, directors of uh, KVDN Association, the staff, and uh, all of you for being here today. And um, we, we did work hard in this country to try to get where we are today. And we always uh, try to sponsor the nonprofit organizations uh, because they're there for good cause. We know that every time they collect donation, they most likely gonna, gonna, gonna give it to people that are most needed out there. So we're very proud and we, we be happy to say and confident to say that we're gonna continue to support as much as you can, we can, in order to work together with the, with the community. Um, thank you. Uh, again, thank you very much. This is a, <laughs> a very, very happy moment for us to, to be recognized in the city of Brockton. Thank you. Thank you, Domingos. So it's my pleasure to represent the next Community Service Award. Um, it's an honor for me because this person is actually one of my own mentors, supporters, and good friends. Um, I'd like to call up Kenny Montero for the first Community Service Award. Kenny has been volunteering in the community since high school, and he's really, really, really old, so we know that's a long time. <laughs> um, he also works, he started the FAM program out of Bridgewater State, he's working in Boston College and continues to mentor both young and old in the city today, so we'd like to recognize Kenny Montero. And he comes from a really good looking family that I like to say that I also come from. Uh, let's go. 
<laughs> um, just want to thank the Cape Verde Association for this award. Um, it always feels good to be recognized for the work that you do for the community. Um, and truly hope that it inspires others to get involved in the community, especially the young folks in the room. Um, I've been doing this work since I was 14 at the Boys and Girls Club of Brockton. Um, and yeah, thank you, thank you. And hopefully continue to do this work. I am getting a bit old, somewhat. Um, <laughs> um, but again, I just truly hope that a lot of young folks in the room get uh, inspired to do this type of work, to be a voice for um, you know social justice issues and do community service, and truly focus on education as well, because that's really your key to the future. So um, thank you once again, K. Verde Association, and everyone in the room for showing me love as well. So thank you. Our next Community Service Award goes to Justiano Fernandez. He is the creator of CV World, which raises awareness of our community Whoa. issues, <laughs> highlighting the things that matter to our community. He's also a great musician and partner to the Cape Verde Association, highlighting a lot of our events, a lot of the items that we want to discuss, things that we're doing throughout the community. So we wanted to recognize Justin for just being a voice, because so often we don't have one. Two minutes? What? Don't take this. That's a lot. I brought a whole book. <laughs> uh, no, I'm just joking. I can't joke with Cape Verdeans, man. <laughs> they put me on Cabo video. May I? This is very important. May I? Sure. Do I have your permission? Yes, you do. Okay, don't complain afterwards. It's going to be brief, but I'm going to hit it to the point. Oh, yeah. Moses, you should have never got me up here, man. Some people say, okay, he's getting an award. What has he done? And some people lay, lean back and just does the work and don't wait for no results. Just keep doing the good work, and eventually we'll get there. So just to give you some of the stuff that I've been involved with, not to toot my own horn, because there's plenty of you guys in here that have done more than I, what I've done over here. So for those people, I'm here still fighting, a good fight. 1998, I created CV World. Didn't, rep, didn't present it to the community. Sit down, yes, have a seat. 2002, took IMS to Canada. It was a group of teenagers to Canada because, as you know, in our community, many people don't get to go anywhere, and the only thing they see is around the surroundings. So I created a program, and I took uh, about 18 kids to Canada to go play basketball. You tired? No, my feet really hurt, so I was really hoping so you I'll would speed go. It up. Yeah, I'll two speed minutes. it up. Okay. Fast forward into 2012, I've done so many things, I can't read it, so it's okay. Established CV World as an enterprise. 2013 CV World uh, did a red carpet gala to make sure we recognize our local artists and also our local eaters, uh, leaders in our community, like Muzes. Yeah. There's seven, seven important traits to a leader. Not saying that I'm one, but this is the important traits to being a leader. For us to understand, we have to study those that displayed great leadership. First is empathy, creating a legitimate rapport with your staff so that no, re no resentment can creep up. Right, Moses? Absolutely. Okay. Consistency, being consistent, leader will get your respect and credibility. Honesty, want me to hold it? Yeah. Yeah, okay. I felt that. She almost <laughs> fell down. Honesty. Those who are honest, especially about concerns, make it far more likely 
that obstacles will be addressed rather than avoided. Communications helps keep the team working on right projects with the right attitude. Flexibility. Flexibility, not every problem demands the same solutions. You have to be open-minded. Conviction, a strong vision, witness to see it through, is one of the most important characteristics. And lastly, direction. Having the vision to break out of the norm and aim for great things then to have the will at all to see it through, if it's necessary, to get there. And that's leadership. I am honored, I, I am honored to be on stage with great people. I am honored to be amongst my people, the Cape Verdean people, the great Cape Verdean people that have struggled through so many generations so that we can be in this hall today and celebrate who we are, our legacy, our tradition, our history of being great. Throughout history, we've been held back, but we will not be held back any longer, especially in the city where we are the majority, right here in Brockton. We never were stopped before. We wasn't stopped then. We will never be stopped. And so success is only in front of us. But remember this. I want you to remember this. This is very important. No civilization on the history of the planet ever had success or continue living without the concept of family. No civilization throughout history of this planet can go forward without family. So you're going to be hearing more of the band a little later, but right now we're going to have a local artist that I know many of you guys know, as well as a group of his dancers that are also here to accompany him. So please welcome to the stage, Chesku. Tá fazendo tempo que está sentindo assim, bem afastado de mim. Que fogo entre nós, está sentindo tá de mim. Por favor, não desista. Minha cor está tremendo, falta de que eu vou ganhar. Falta de que eu vou amor E as braços também Não é de ouvir só que eu vou amor Espera que eu vou aconchego Por isso que me dá perigo Só um toque Só um beijo É tudo um dá perigo Let's 
Francesca, che mi canta una cosa, io ci ho sentito la morte che la fa, e da lì ci ho cucito, un po' di tu volevo, la vita ci ho parlato, mancata di la testa, e che avresti mostrato, che gli hai ricordato,
your chest. We'll give them another round of applause, guys. Great job, Chesky. So this next artist is another local artist. Um, I sing a, a little bit, a little bit, and I had the pleasure of singing at her wedding. I felt honored, and I've always admired her ever since. So it is my pleasure to announce that our next artist is Isadora. Give a round of applause, guys. Brockton. No. Good evening, Brockton. Before I sing this song, I would love to see all of you guys right here. Okay? I hope you guys are enjoying your evening, and I hope you guys love the entertainment.
Thank you. My next track is called Down Tempo. Thank you. 
applause, guys. Give her another round of applause. The next person that we have coming up for you guys is Vargas. Give him a round of applause. That's it. And then your man, you're coming. That's it. Come on, why are you guys all dead? Come on. Just the quest of any of you. Si vous que la bande peut battre, y'a man, you're coming, man. All right. First of all, I want to say thank you to the Verde Association for inviting me. It's an honor to be here. And uh, from the start, I was there, and I will continue to make myself available for you guys all the time. Thank you so much. And I want to dedicate this song to my best friend, my brother, my father, a companion on stage. My brother, Nyo Nyo. And my manager too. Okay, let's go guys. And I want to see you guys dancing, please. Please. Sinanta, show my police, sheriff, study anyways. The port of buzzing your stick at you, um, please. I turned you back. No, 
Produced by my man, my brother, my father. Meu melhor amigo, um, um amigo de tudo alguém, nho nho. E ele que escreveu as músicas, ele que fez a melodia das músicas, foi cantado com a Sandro e mim. Mas foi especial para ele como ele é uma pessoa que ainda estima. Cheio, cheio, cheio demais. Love you, brother. All right. Okay. Let's see if you guys can jam with me with this one. Stay right here. You ain't going nowhere. Stay right here. <laughs> You're grounded to the floor, to the dance floor, I mean. Okay, this next song especially for my baby, my wife, the love of my life. Sing, I love you, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Olhos nos olhos, tanta vida pra viver Charminho doce, pedacinho de você Diz a frase certa, só você sabe me abrir É só assim que eu consigo descobrir Como é gostoso me entregar e te sentir
This is for my beautiful ladies right here. Stella, 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 Stella,
vaca esgoa. Ele deixa a água ali, ele deixa tudo o que ali. Ali na Facebook, ok? Claro, mas uma coisa cheia de mulher bonita. A mim que está falando, não. Mas a mim que hoje não vai ter a luz disso na hoje. Por favor, toda mulher bonita vem para a parte. O Antônio é um especial guest. Mas toda mulher que é bonita, feia para crer. Só bonita. Se for é feia, chinta. Bonita, entendeu? Mas complexada. Mas levanta a mulher cá, verdiana. Ok, e os que criam hoje a mais? Não. E os que criam hoje a mais? Não. Quero que eles não falem. Ah, Maria, bom. Please, I need everybody to come over here. Se for duas palavras, Dennis Graça. Dennis Graça, você vem por fome? E se for Dennis Graça, você está lá para você também, não vem? Ok. A mim te mente, em como hoje é muito difícil, assim nunca se começa. Eu estou aqui para ele. I got patience. Ok, ok, ela está bem. Devagar, mas está bem. Devagar, devagar. Gates, dê as graças, está por parado. A mim me se põe o estudo dele, por exemplo, pode ser sabe. Mode que nós música, tão bonito, no mundo inteiro. A hora que não está cantando, tudo é enxintado. Uma hora que não vem o concerto. Lá no outro terra, que é que eu achei Cá Verdeano, Cá Verdeano da Canta, que é que eu achei. Não nos é complexado. Cá é uma altura que é uma cabeleira, bacão de fazer unha, compra vestido. Hã? Cá é uma pinta de vinte branco, mesmo mesmo. Não quer saber da mentira. Não quer saber da mentira. Tudo o que é hoje, tudo o dia, mais ou menos, 12 horas na speed hoje. Ou oh, não? Ou oh, não? Ok. Guedes, eu estou preparado para ouvir um grande cantor na parte. Fazer barulho! Que ela gosta fraco, go. Como ainda há tempo que ainda fazer minha música, tem mais barulho. Fazer! Mais ou menos. Joe, you gotta help me. You really gotta help. Para um olhão duas ali. Quem é que é o dia mais bonito do mundo? É de onde? Não se vê? De França? Não, de França. Cusé? Grande amigo de meu, já não dura na IEL. Já não dura na IEL, na parte do Around the World. É um grande cantor, como que os cantores que ia ver ali. Não tinha Chesco, grande cantor. Não tinha Vargas, grande cantor. Não tinha Isidora, grande cantor. Não tinha Tatiana, Ingrid. Não tinha que os grandes músicos. Palmo, palmo para os grandes músicos. Ah, vou ter que estar aquele fato ali, mano. A sério, gente. Faz o barulho! Pá! Dê nas graças! Barulho! Barulho!
Chiga perto, eles mandam chão a menis, chiga perto. <laughs> Even you guys, you guys can come a little bit closer. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Come closer. It's okay, come. He doesn't bite, I promise. He's harmless. Um croia, antes de continuar, um croia, as outras limanões, ok? Tudo começa quando o moinho passa na frente e eu pensar Eles lhe te ensinam e tudo coisa muda e a vida melhora Sou um... Fazer o quê? Fazer Que ninguém te escape bom e bom Oh, 
Ok, agora um colega só está só está pronto para uma cozinha mais quente, uma cozinha mais terra terra. Só está pronto. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? Are we ready? Yeah. 
Que os outros é o quê? 20, 10, 30? Quem que sabe por ser de mulher com cultura? <risos> Boa sete e dez, né? Eu se consigo música 100% mulher, eu se consigo. Eu não sei o nome? 
significado muito importante é sobre amor. É uma mulher que se atajura em amor eterno para ser amor de vida. E crê para tudo, mulher, canta junto comigo para dar uma força, ok? Right, let's go.
Guys, Dennis, I know you come from way back, way back. I want you to bring it back as far as Splash. Do you think you can do that? Do you guys want that? Then we leave this one for last. You guys want, let me go for, you want to leave it for last? I'm gonna follow my big, big brother George. I'm gonna follow him. I'm gonna. You guys ready to go back? Yeah. Are you ready to go back in time? Yeah. I want to see if you guys are ready. If you still remember this one. I think George did something that wasn't... George, it was not the right timing, man. It was not the right timing. Oh, <laughs> my George. What's up, baby? But I want to see if you guys are ready.
So thank you que vos saí de boa casa, que vos vai fazer boa unha. Homens compra esses fatos. Muito obrigado de fundo de minha coração. Because senhores castan, nunca desiste. Thank you very much. De fundo de minha coração.